Hey, Emily. Hello. There's a password. 11-year-old Emily admits she was a little skeptical about getting a ride with a stranger. I'm like, uh, okay, I don't know. <laughs> Are they selling me off to the black market? Emily still gave Hop Skip Drive a shot today. Her driver, Joy, lived up to her name. We had a full conversation, so it's not like I'm just sitting in the car with a person who's not talking to me. The service works a lot like other ride-sharing companies. We we're always like, well, I can't just stick her in an Uber. You don't know who's driving, that kind of thing. I can see where people might not be as comfortable with uh, putting their car in their kid in a car with a stranger. Getting to know what the service is definitely helps. Hop Skip Drive says it vets drivers to keep kids safe. They have to have at least five years of caregiving experience. They are background checked, fingerprinted. We do car inspections, driving record checks. Parents can customize instructions for pick up and drop off. Kids use passwords and birthdays to connect with the right driver. During the drive, parents can track where their kids are through the app. This skeptic now says she she'd recommend it to her friends. It's okay, they're not really a stranger, okay? No stranger danger. Brittany Thomason, Arizona's Family.